I want to show my prayer journal and my current traveler's notebook set up to anyone that might be interested. <laughs> In here I'm doing my Bible journaling. I have a prayer journal I just made. I have my regular journal and um, my calendar. I was inspired by Corey Speaker, the Reset Girl, to make a little prayer journal. And I thought well, what would be great is if I had a traveler's notebook that I could just carry around with all my other stuff. Um, so I got this little mini. When I got it, I realized, oh, it won't fit in my other elastic, so it's so big. So I took a, an extra elastic I had, and I popped it through this hole, and, um, and I used that to hold it, and it holds it pretty nicely. And I put it at the top so I can see the cute paper clips. So let me show you what I've got going here. I set it up just like Corey's did. I was like, you know what, her plan sounds great. Let's try that. Actually, I'm going to keep that there. Um, so she set up the pray acronym, praise, repent, ask, yield. So I set mine up the same way. I decorated the cover a little bit. This was so cute, didn't even do much. In my praise section, I used some scriptures. I wrote down some scriptures that I uh, say, to the, say to the Lord when I start my, my prayer time. Uh, some more scripture, and I want to start writing attributes of God right here that I uncover in scripture. So I'll use this potent note to remind me. I left uh, some blank pages because I'm sure I'll want to add stuff later on. Here's the repent section um, with a prayer of repentance, one from church, one from the Psalms, and some things that I need to work on. Uh, and then the next section is ask. So in this section I went ahead and um, Put a picture of my husband and what I'm praying for him for. This is my urgent section. I use this little post-it note uh, to all like emergencies. And th so these are the things I'm praying for every single day. Uh, you know, urgent situations. I set, I made little tabs here. So these are my daily prayers and of the ask session. And these are my weekly prayers. And I have them set up for the days of the week. Okay, so got my husband here prayer concerns from church. Here's all my friends and what I'm praying for them. I'm praying for my parents and my church. I'm praying for my babies. On this page, I'm going to put a little picture of them because Corey had done that and I just really um, like that. The things I'm praying for myself. And then on Sunday, um, I'm praying for my church and widows and orphans and my marriage, just like um, Corey did. And I thought, oh, that's just great. And then I'm praying on Monday for my husband and my dad's job, Tuesday for God's will to be done, for unbelievers, again, this is just like Corey, um, my government, my friends, Thursday, um, so a little, something different every day, and then the last part's yield, where I listen and be still, and this is a um, part I need to work on the most, I'm going to write down some signs from God and conditions for hearing God's voice, and in the very back, I'm starting to write down my answered prayers, um, and here's some more psalms of praise I can reference and some scripture that I can pray over different people uh, and, and notes. So there you have it. I'm just really excited about this and it's really helped me in my prayer time. I can be a bit of a uh, distracted person and when I'm, when I'm using this during my prayer time, uh, I'm staying focused and I'm remembering all the things I'm praying for and people ask me to pray for something I'm not forgetting and I'm, I'm, I'm writing it down right away and I'm praying for them every single day if it's a, an urgent thing. So just wanted to share with you all.